Right then. Now, a lot of people who follow my channel and who follow Joe's channel also follow a chap called Whistling Diesel. And as you all probably know, if you follow him on Instagram or YouTube, he got a tank off Joe about six months ago now. And when he bought it, he came over to have a play. Um, at the time, he came, had a play, and as you've probably seen, he broke the tank. Now, people have been going on at me for ages to put up the video I took then. I'll apologise now, it's a bit discombobulated. Uh, we were concentrating on getting footage for his video rather than ours, uh, but I finally got time to edit it all together and upload it. Now, that is because I am currently in Lancaster Park and Ride, broken down in a transit, waiting for the big yellow taxi to show up and take me to work. But my pain is your gain. I've finally got this video together. Like I say, it is a bit humbledy jumbledy, so I'll jump in here and there to tell you what's going off and explain what's happening, why we're doing certain things. Because I'm sure all the army recovery chaps and Remy recovery chaps will tell us we're doing it wrong. But we might have been. But it were our first heavy tank recovery and we got it done. We got the thing out, we sorted the job out, so we can't have been doing it that wrong. Anyway, here's the live action, hope you enjoy it. Um, I'm sure you'll let us know what we did wrong and how we nearly killed ourselves in the comments below. But yeah, enjoy. <laughs>
there's some footage of the track, he's going to throw it off. You look at the strain that track's on there. Look at the Atlas rocket. As you can see in the video the combination of what is probably a bit of a loose track the angle of that bank which the video doesn't do it justice that's a railway embankment so it's fairly steep but it's also quite loose as you can see the the material from it's piled up under that track where he's been working backwards and forwards putting all the pressure of the weight of the tank on that one track which was just enough while it was under load trying to push that tree to make that rear sprocket skip a tooth and work the track off which then effectively makes that track a dead stop because it's on the front idlers and everything but the sprocket's got nothing to grip into to turn it's like trying to turn a locked track so at this point we tried working it backwards and forwards a bit we gave in and admitted we needed to recover it now the best way of doing this is get the track cut get it off so the thing will freewheel and get it up somewhere you can put the track back on uh, but it is in a horrible position. That tree root is now firmly jammed underneath the tank with 55, 56 tonnes on top of it, on an angle, on a slope, loose. Who has hit the fan? So get the Foden out, get the winch cables on, see if we can get that stump out and see if we can get this thing moving. <laughs> So Joe, what's the tool for getting the uh, stuck chieftain tank out? Job done. Good to go. Let's get winch face on, Joe. Go on, investing. Do you know what you're doing? <laughs> We'll re-rig it in a minute. Right, well, I'll re-rig it and put it around the other one. Sorry. Need that other one off. Whoa! Yeah. Turn that other noggin off, Joe. I think you've got it. We're declaring war. <laughs> <laughs> So close to the strap. <laughs> so close to the strap. Is that legal? Only okay, Adam. And then I just decide to fight China. So I slip off that. that. Mm. Probably gonna slip. As long as you I'm say. Slip. So we need to. Did you get that? 
We rig it. We drive through the bridges in Madison. Oh. Is it even the Yeah. Either way, yeah. Well, it's the time. It was kind of under it. It's holding it there. Did you ever have, you ever have tanks out here before he got in here? It's almost like he's fucked up with a chieftain before. Keep going. Steady, Turns blocked or something. I'll bring my uh, pressure testers down next week. Yeah, he'll pull itself into the ground when he starts winching. Yeah. 
the best situation we got here. It's stuck. Yeah, we'll try it. tank free now it's off the tree route that it was sort of beached on um but that track still ain't turning it's just dead weight we're never going to drag it the winch on the Foden is incredible and um, adam who you've seen in the videos who actually knows how to operate it properly has found the i forgot what they call it like the combat button that overrides all the hydraulic safeties it's still really struggling to drag it with that track on so track's got to come off easiest way to do that is fire now, Joe drew the short straw and had to chop it off and risk losing a hand, but he's not that important, so and I'd rather he lost his hand than me lose mine. I had the much more important job of fetching McDonald's. So, we'll see if we get this track off and then attempt to get, to get this thing up the hill. Yikes. Right, that'll do that. Just do it sweet to eat. That's brilliant. Right, Seb, if you just want to lick that cold, that'd be grand. Right, yeah, shall, no we, shall we try and so, shall we try and winch the track out? Yep. Oh, that's my job over. Let's uh, let's one else have a nice cut. <laughs> nice cut. I don't think I have any hairs on my hand. Uh Big Mac, that ain't mine. Oh, that might be mine. You got all my cheeseburgers. Hey, we were down here working. Yeah, it, what were you doing? Oh, Eating a yeah, Big wait, Mac? So they forgot the cheeseburgers. They didn't we got drinks. Out. We're missing six burgers. Six? Yeah. We're missing six burgers. Where's and, he gone? And the Big Tasties? I've sent him back. No, there's like nothing left, man. There's no Big Tasties left? No, I ate the Big Tasties. <laughs> that was for me. Yeah, me neither. I'd stand nowhere near them because they've crossed. That does not sound fucking good. Oh, that sounds horrible. Oh, she's going. She's going. She's pulling the track out. Someone watching, so it's I don't think last. it's going to do anything when it goes. No, but it'll trap that other bar you see, and then we've got to uh, try and get that out. Uh, oh, yeah. Wait a minute, have we got. <laughs> yeah, we've just replaced that bar with that we're bar. Yeah. One. You don't need to push one oh, again. That's just moved it. There we go. Yeah? Yeah. Right, go on and knock it out. Try not to miss. Yep. Oh. Put a bit more pressure on it. Go on, keep going. Yeah. Oh. Careful. 
A bit more pressure. Is that bar on the right getting stuck yet? Is that stuck yet? No. Close. Ready? Yep. Hold on, hold on. Right. What? Not yet. yet. Well, where is it? Because it doesn't. It only needs to leave there. Well, yeah, but I know, but it's probably here somewhere. Go on, keep tapping it. Keep tapping it. Come on, Paul. Yeah. It's mine. Beautiful. Got it. That one's stuck. That is now nicely stuck in there. Yeah. That one's stuck pretty well. Try winch, just tie it in. No, there. no, it's all right. Hang on. Well, now we put this no, one in. No, we need in a and smaller one back up. <laughs> we need a smaller pin. Now, yeah, now we need get a piece of spaghetti. We'll work our way down to a piece of spaghetti. Right. Pass us a hammer. A piece of spaghetti. <laughs> Pass us a hammer. 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 Pass us a just try. Um, I think we need to get a binder on it. Go and get one of the binders so we can crimp up Jack's side. Yeah. Yeah. Just you seriously don't have any car jacks or anything? You put a jack right here and it will yeah, just, just push straight, straight into the ground. The soil. Go and get a binder on them quick. Their dirt must be like foam here. Oh, it, it is. is. Well, this yeah, is. You, uh, you, can't, you can't put anything on the ground. Not even tanks. No. I, you've shown quite nicely. <laughs> like it. How'd you acquire so much tank shit in two years? Just spending a lot of money. Just, <laughs> That's fair, th this was from someone on TikTok. It's like, oh, my granddad's got a tank. They'd be interested in buying it. It's like, yeah. It's amazing how much shit I've got from there. No, no. No. <laughs> of course you should. Mind if I cut that end up? That should do it. I think get a binder up there and I'll pull it up there, same as the other rest. We've got a big chisel. Yeah, it's not a proper one. Uh, no. I'll start just chiseling at that. Where are we going to hook it up here? We'll go off this point up here. We don't have a long chain. We have a longer chain. Here. Like two feet long. That'll be a fun. I can go through we this island. We can go island. here. Why don't we go here? We've got an island. We can go off this island. Yeah, that'll work. Why don't we get another strap quick? We'll do that because I don't think the strap's going to have the pressure. Well, that's new. I've never seen two binders to do a job. This is desperate. This is desperate. Two binders, one ratchet strap, 17 people, one clevis, <laughs> large chain, fully clevis with large hook, with long cable. One gallon of WD-40. One, three different bars. So 12 spectators. 12 potatoes. <laughs> potatoes. It's working. 31 cups. Right, see you. on that hammer again. 31's light. Okay, Good old English work ethic. Fucking... Come on, monkey. Go here. <laughs> Might need one more. Just fucking tap it out. Well, just tighten it a little bit and then it'll. No, it won't. Just put the fucking pole back in it and I'll snap back it again. Oh, or we could just bend, bend it for no bend fucking it more reason. Than you need to. Yeah. We don't look this bad on camera, do we? No, no. No. Okay. He's doing a fucking good job of looking absolutely useless. <laughs> and look at, like an ape. You, your big head's in the light as well. We're we the same on there we go. Look what, at that. Fucking, what are you messing around at, boys? It's because it's bird. Yeah, it's, it's pretty bird, mushroom, but fucking hell. You keep pulling. Ready? There we go. Bad Lucy. Hey, there we hey, go. Hey, 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 hey Tyler got it. That was fucking. Um, well, that means you're king of England now. Uh, oh. I don't want it. <laughs> <laughs> no thanks. <laughs> I'm gonna put it on eBay. <laughs> I think I did it. Somehow, no idea how. 
we did have to teach the Americans how to use a sledgehammer. It seems like none of them could, could master it. But big job done. So next thing now is to try and get the actual tank itself winched up that bank. Like I said, we were very lucky to be joined by Adam on this one because without him we would have been screwed. None of us know how to use that wrecker. Um, Joe's got an idea now, but he knows how to use it properly, knew how to set the winches up properly, how to work everything. We'd have been screwed without him. Um, but yeah, so now comes the attempt to winch 56 ton. I think it's 56 ton, it might be more than that, might be less. I'm sure someone will tell me I'm wrong down in the comments as usual. But yeah, now we're about to attempt to winch that up a, a railway embankment with one Foden. So yeah, this went well. She's moving. British built recovery truck and it's raining. Rolls Royce engine. Really? Yeah. I'm going to need that on the ship too. So we're looking to see if that other track's turning. Yeah, yeah it's turning. Are we going to clear that fucking tree? I don't think it's going to stop. <laughs> We can move it in a minute and move the phone in. Well, we huh? We'll get it halfway up, then we can block it, we'll move the phone in. The tree. Yeah. Oh, Let's lower the gun and fucking put the gun and in the just ground. Just bear in mind now, if it snaps, it will roll. Yeah, forward. do not get in front of it. Jack, just hold it there while we reposition the. Uh... Yeah, yeah, let me just lean on this front one, Yeah, yeah, you just lean on that. You're good at leaning on stuff. I think it took that right to the back of the truck. Told you we needed a photo. Just make sure that other track ain't jumping off. Kinky bitch. She's a kinky bitch. So now we'll do away with that cake. So around 120 ton of pull now on that.
chop you in half. No, so, I want to die. We die like men. So she's out and clear, we're fucked. Now we're going to tidy up. Oh, the Hilux is trying to do what the uh, Defender did. My defender got up here, so he better. Slip the clutch. He's gonna hit that bump at the start. <laughs> <and it's> <laughs> <laughs> So the defender got up this. No problem. Right, Raptor's turn. I think not. <laughs> so yeah, that about wraps up um, Cody's visit to England. Uh, the next day, the, I wasn't there unfortunately, but they got the track back on the tank, did a bit of titivating and got it up and running again. Um, if you want to see it in action, it is now over in America. It's at Whistling Diesel's place. Uh, if you check out his Instagram, there's a few pictures of some trouble he had after he got it off the boat. Have a look. I'm pretty sure he's got a video coming out soon featuring it. Um, I can't wait to see what he does with it, to be honest. Hopefully he breaks it enough so that we have to fly over and fix it because well, that'd be a good holiday. But yeah, um, if you like what we do, we do uh, check out the links below. There's links to my Instagram, Joe's Instagram. You can see what we're up to a bit before we get, get on with it. And yeah, more videos to come. I'm cracking on with the editing again, as you can see. So have a good one and I'll see thee.